Hi again, I'm Michael. I'm Hunter. And we are? Commentating Critics. So today we're going to be trying out uh, at least go somewhere I haven't tried before and I haven't eaten it before. But I, so Hunter's been here before and he says he likes it a lot. So we want you to come on our journey and see how it tastes. Let's go. Alright. About the chimichanga platter with ground beef in it, topped with queso, with rice and beans, and get some meat on there. Mm -hmm. Very, 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 very good. Now, Rice and beans. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So you can say? It's so good that I can't say anything. Ten out of ten. <laughs> Your turn. So I ended up choosing the master pedillion, I think it was called, but basically it's fajitas. So the plate actually comes with uh, steak, chicken. It's got beef with uh, what's this stuff called again, Jackie? The beef. The chorizo. The chorizo. And, and, also has shrimp. So, but for my sake, I'm just gonna do steak and chicken. Again. Except for the things of this channel, apparently. The things that um, they're planning us to eat aren't on my diet, but I'm gonna try. So, oh, there we go. Oh, see it. Really good. Well cooked. Tastes like a high end restaurant made as far as the steak, the chicken. I'm not really a big fan of shrimp. Oh, unless it's fried. But I do understand if I want to continue to do the things like Hunter wants to do with this channel, I'm going to have to try some additional things. So I'll try a piece of the shrimp. Just about it. But. I'm just not a big fan of shrimp other than fried. It does taste good. I mean, it's got good spice. And what do I put the guacamole on? Just. I've never had guacamole, by the way. big fan of guacamole. I mean, that's the first I've ever had it, but I don't like the taste, the texture, or the coldness behind it. But all in all, it's really good. I really like the steak and chicken, or steak and the yeah, chicken together. And then I'm going to try some of the chorizo with the beef. Again, a little cheese. Just told me that I've had trees before. She 
actually put it in chili and I probably just didn't know it. So. The keto chili. Which we may throw some of that stuff in here too. Here, get that right here on the camera quick. Really often we do things that make. on a fajita. Usually I stick with just steak and chicken wherever I go. So I don't know exactly what is proper to put on chorizo beef, but I really like it here. I think it's a really good match. So Uncle Michael just bit into something and his mouth is on fire. Where did it come from, Uncle Michael? I don't know. Somewhere in here? I don't know. It was like a seed. I know I bit down, I felt it in the gut, and all of a sudden, I can't talk. So, worse than the hot sriracha chocolate? Much. That worse. sweet tea was full before. Unsweet. Unsweet tea. Unsweet tea, by the way. Mm. With Splenda. Yeah, I'm cheating in nothing. <laughs> you handed me this one. Well, no, you're really supposed to be in great tea, you're supposed to do it without. That's a sin. Unsweet tea is a sin. You got it, you got it in the side of the dirty tea. Yes. Okay. Yeah, it just burns. Chips are very good, by the way. I recommend it with the Alright, we're good. Cut.